Hi, everyone, welcome back to RAS Aquaculture Channel. Today, we're excited to show you the latest update on our new fish tank build. This is one of the biggest upgrades we've done so far. From tank reinforcement to leak testing, and even our future aquaponic plans, there's a lot happening here, so stay tuned. This tank measures 6 meters in diameter and 1.41 meters in height, making it capable of holding a substantial amount of water. Our ideal for our upcoming aquaponics setup that will support both fish and plant growth. To keep the tank from bursting under water pressure, we installed broader tightening rings made from flat bar mild steel. These rings wrap around the tank to provide strong structural support and help maintain the shape. As the water level rises, they're spaced evenly from top to bottom to ensure the entire tank is reinforced. Each ring is joined end-to-end -end using bolts and nuts for strong, secure support around the tank. To make tightening easier and ensure consistent tension around the tank, we added turnbuckles between the flat bar rings. This allows for precise adjustment and helps maintain the structural integrity of the tank as it fills with water. Inside the main tank, we placed an additional HDPE tank to serve as the inner lining and main water container to keep it firmly in place. We used heavy-duty ropes to securely tie it to the outer steel tightening rings. This added layer not only improves durability, but also prevents the tank from shifting or collapsing during operation. With the setup in place, we are now in the process of filling the tank with water to carefully check for any signs of leakage or structural weakness before connecting the filtration system. This tank will soon be equipped with a complete water filtration system designed to maintain optimal water quality for both fish and plants. The filtration unit will be directly connected to our aquaponics grow bed, allowing nutrient-rich water from the fish tank to circulate through the plant roots and return. Clean back to the tank, which can creating a closed loop, sustainable ecosystem. In the near future, this system will support the growth of a variety of vegetables and herbs, offering both fresh produce and an efficient way to recycle fish waste as natural fertilizer. Some of the best crop choices for this type of system include leafy greens like lettuce, spinach, and pak choy, as well as herbs like basil and mint. With proper care and balance, even fruiting plants like tomatoes and chilies can thrive in this integrated aquaponics setup. Lastly, if you enjoyed the video, don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel and give us a thumbs up. That's all for today's video. We hope it helps you better care for your crabs and shrimps. Bye!